this system of linear equations at UC on the left can be written in a form called matrices. A matrix is a row by column series of numbers changed or, or manipulated to give you answers similar to the ones that you saw Okay, so basically, <clears throat> we're looking at right now 3x minus 4y equals negative 1, 2x plus 4y equals 26, and we're looking at that as a system of linear equations. Okay, and what we're going to do is we're actually going to look at that system a little differently. Uh, we're going to write it in such a way that we're going to put it in matrix form. So you notice that each of these terms right here have numbers or what we call coefficients. This term has a coefficient of 3. This term has a coefficient of negative 4. This has a constant coefficient of negative 1. This term has the numeric coefficient of 2. This term has a numeric coefficient of 4, and this term has a constant coefficient of 26. So I can write this as a matrix. Okay, So our matrix, if I were to take this system of linear equations and write it as a matrix, we would write this in the following fashion. We would go 3, negative 4, and negative 1. We would go 2, 4, and 26. So this has two rows and three columns. Two rows. This is row 1. So this whole thing is row 1. This is row 2. So this whole thing is row two. This is column one. This is column two. This is column three. So this would be considered, so this three, negative four, negative one, two, 26 is considered a 2 by 3 this is means by it's a 2 by 3 matrix okay 2 by 3 matrix okay so notice that these first terms are your x terms. These are your y terms. These are your these are your y numeric coefficients. And these are your constant or new or numbers. This is your constant row right here. 
Okay. So, <clears throat> what do we do with this? Okay. Uh, well, first, I want to make sure we understand totally that um, how this goes back and forth. So, for instance, I know on your practice worksheet, you were given matrices that look like this. So, for instance, you had, uh, on, I believe on one of your questions, you had a matrix that had two, five, and then a three. And then you had a one, two, and six. Well, this basically translates into 2x plus 5y equals 3 and 1x plus 2y equals 6. So that's basically taking a matrix and turning it into a system of equations. So it goes both ways. You can either take the system of equations and turn it into a matrix or you can take a matrix and turn it into a system of equations. All right, um, so for instance, if I were to give you, let's just take the last one. If I were to take, um, if you're looking at number 10, look at number 10. Look at number 10 on your 242 checkup worksheet. 2.4.2 um, checkup worksheet. You will see you're given a, a system of equations 3x minus 5y. three X minus five Y equals negative two. And you're also given two X plus nine Y. Two X plus nine Y equals negative 26. Okay. So this can simply be turned into the matrix 3, negative 5, negative 2, and we have 2, 9, and negative 26. Boom. You're done.